This is my pink Dalmatian. This is the original battery compartment. It has no batteries inside. This is a custom adapter jack eye dog leg, which, which I, I soldered through. I used a soldering iron to melt the plastic to slide this adapter jack through. And I wired it up to these two pieces of tin foil. And so what you do here is you take these pieces of tin foil and you put them into where the con into where the contacts are on the battery compartment. Like so. You screw the battery compartment in. Or it's not really a battery compartment anymore. By the way, this is from a fried eye dog, so don't worry. I, my red is my red eye dog is still fine. It still has its original leg. This works with all original eye dogs, by the way, because it can come on and off. And now, look at this. In case you ever try to attempt this yourself, always use a three volt adapter. Go no more, no less, because these run on three volts. And look at that. We have what is most likely the world's first adapter-based eye dog. I mean, maybe not. I don't know. Somebody else off of YouTube probably did this first. I don't know. Maybe I'm the first, but I doubt that. But you will never have to worry about your eye dog ever running out of battery again. And if you, and that's actually kind of why I did this. Obviously, I'm not gonna run them like 24/7 to like the point where our stuff breaks and the motor dies, but like, um, <clears throat> the reason I made this is because when I'm running my eye dogs on batteries, um, when I'm running my eye dogs on batteries, like, um, when you turn the, when the batteries are low, the motor will move slower. And actually when you wake eye dogs up, they actually flap their ears. That's them testing their battery. If their ears move fast then the motor's going to move slower, if the ears move slow via the low batteries, then it's going to move faster. So when the batteries are lower, the battery is going to die quicker. And whenever I do that, I just like get really anxious about that. Cause I'm like, Oh crap, it's going to die soon. I don't know why. So this is a solution to that. So I won't have to worry about that anymore. I'm currently also working on this for iDog amps, but I need to find another adapter jack. Uh, but um, with amps, it's 4.5 volts because they take three AA batteries instead of two. So that's, short little um yeah quick little kind of rushed video <laughs> no batteries just all adapter so yeah thanks for watching this terrible rushed video <laughs> yeah that's yeah that's it